In 14 years of education in SSHK, our school aims to provide our students with a rich learning experience and a culture of care. In SSHK, we have developed a character and global citizenship framework that looks into two main components, character education and global citizenship education. In the main core centre of the framework is our school values, namely respect, responsibility, resilience, integrity, care and harmony. We have developed various modules, for example, the respect booklet, to engage the parents in home conversations with their children at home. So it's a total whole school approach that we are talking about when we, talk, when we want to inculcate character education. It's not a one-size-fits-all, and there's no magical formula about this. So the values that the school has taught me has affected my daily life, so um, I can apply them um, and remember them when I need them. Um, I believe like the values help me a lot, make me more confident and um, let me try things and let me get actually good at something. Here at SIS HK, we try to build a strong mathematical foundation from young. Through the spiral design of our curriculum, students will be able to build on their prior knowledge to learn new knowledge, which translates to the joy of understanding for deep learning and mastery. I think each child is different and unique, and I think to every child, the joy of learning means something different. So to one child, it may be making a mistake and then learning from it. To another child, it may be solving a question and wanting to challenge themselves. So making it even trickier for them and having a go doing something that they really need to apply their thinking skills to. At SIS, maths is a lot of fun to learn. It's very joyful. For division, uh, to highlight on the grouping and sharing concepts, I took my classroom downstairs to the playground in our school where we used hula hoops and we were in groups, we grouped ourselves, we split ourselves, divided ourselves and shared ourselves in groups to learn about how we can use division outside the classroom. So generally, when we are planning a concept to teach, we always start from the known and we move towards the unknown. Get through that way, we can scaffold the kids learning, we can um, help them. Some children need a little bit more support with the concrete. This approach provides fun and joyful experiences for our students, thereby building their confidence and interest in the subject. We really believe that the performing arts, dance, music and drama provides skills for the future, which are highly sought after by employers, but are also so valuable for these students' personal development. The performing arts is transformational. We've seen students who are very, very shy go through these processes and become very confident. We need to be able to communicate respectfully, we need to cooperate respectfully with each other to address those challenges that are here now and in the future, which is why the holistic addition of performing arts to SISHK is so valuable and should be celebrated. <laughs>